Look at it too much. I thought I had a lot of heart. And I also thought it was really gritty. It's not pulling any punches. <laughs> you know, no pun intended. You can't fight like that anymore. Think about her. You got hit a lot, Dad. South Pole's about a fighter who's from the top and falls to the bottom. He has to learn how to become a father. He has to learn how to become a better human being. You are all I care about. The three of us. That's it. That's all that matters. So I'm going to tell you the truth. You're going to be punch drunk in two years if you keep this up. Maureen's kind of tiger mom a little bit. I mean, she doesn't want anybody coming anywhere near her family. She's super protective, maybe to a fault even. Put your pants on. <laughs> Let's go so we can get home, okay? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Antoine seems to love Billy and Maureen's relationship, I think. He says he says that all the time. That he loves these guys and he, he doesn't want to let them go. Yeah, they don't they don't exist without each other. It was so important that it was real love, that it was genuine. And when me and Jake uh, sat down and met Rachel, it was almost instant. You know, with Rachel, it's pretty amazing because I think she prides herself really on her preparation and a certain type of structure. And Antoine really blew that up. You know, it was like we were playing and improving things and trying things out, and she just was totally game. Please, five, please. She's dope. You got a, uh, interesting choices, like when she actually gets in the scene, because I didn't expect her to be as uh, aggressive at different points. Well, I mean, Billy's been my fighter for 10 years. I know what's best for him. And I've been his wife for like 100. I know what's better for him. First day Rachel came to the set, we were filming some of the boxing stuff. She had her coffee, she was in her regular clothes and everything, and I had the cameras going. I literally told Billy, just go grab her, pull her up on the ring, just start kissing her. And she went right there with him. And afterwards, she was just like, I don't know what film I'm in right now, what's going on? And so right away, I said, yeah, she's the one. And that's the sort of energy. And she was training in boxing, and she did that. I did a little bit of training, you know, a little bit of boxing with his coach, Terry Claybon, who's amazing, just to get a sense of what it is, you know, just to understand it better. And there's a few interviews I found of boxers' wives talking about a day in the life or what they do. She wanted to understand what it felt like, what it smelled like. And she wanted to make sure she knew what she was saying to him when she's saying you're taking too many punches. She actually understood that because she was around it so much. Until you hear a cut, you're on camera. There's going to be boxing scene in this film that hasn't been shot quite like this before. I think they're staying mostly inside the ring and it's really tight and close and you really feel the violence. And even before we started shooting, Jake was so dialed into this character. So, you know, with those two at the helm and the heart and the fire that was already there on the page, I just thought it could be really special. Rose, what's up? Let's go! He needs time off. He'll bite his hand off. You don't give him something else to do with him. Want to go two rounds with me, champ? 